my colleague Bidon de mention, we been trying to reach the All People's Congress APC Party. Now we really get online the National Publicity Secretary for the All People's Congress APC Party, CDI Attorneys. Good morning and welcome to the program. Good morning, Salon, Mr. Attorneys. Good morning. Thank you very much for getting me online. And sorry, I'm not able to at the studio. The outcome of the dialogue with Independent Commission for Peace and National Cohesion and other body their own between the All People's Congress APC Party and Government of Salon. For the All People's Congress APC Party, what do you want to make up of the dialogue? Well, thank you very much. Um, the dialogue now being definitely for address the concerns that we, the APC, been get um, with regards to the June 24, 2023 elections, particularly, and see how we go proffer solution. We go ensure say we bring unity and then uh, we clear all the doubts we we been get surrounding. Uh, the June 24, 2023 elections. Uh, we get three days deliberations outside the leadership of the party be represented at the highest level. And at the end of the day, we get an agreement we um, everybody don't sign to. We are sure say when I go don't read now the studio. So for us as a party, you know, we now get for take that agreement day to we membership and explain to them so that we all go understand what's in the inside day and then also the actions they will they look forward for see as a political party we not go only address the issues and concerns we will be get surrounding the june 24 2023 elections but we also go profile a way who will go ensure say elections that this country could be free fair and credible we, everybody go at the end of the day, accept the outcome, that is one. And secondly, also go, you know, reduce the, the divisiveness, the tension, the, you know, um, disgruntlement, the anger and everything we, we see the go on at this country, you know, relating to politics and also the way how uh, we don't go as a, as a nation. Quick one, you talk about three main things. Um, you talk about uh, concerns the moon have been get during the election. Now for una, the dialogue, we're going to run for CC address and also the action night to una, they take and also talk to our supporters. Them. Talking to your supporters after signing, you think say, this they change anything after we engage with our supporters? Them? Well, it depends on which will be the expectations where people be get uh, from, where people be the get from it which is why if you you know remember some of us really always emphasize that uh, this not dialogue and in the dialogue you don't get for necessarily get 100 percent of which you want uh you get for put you cards on the table somebody else also get for put and when i get for discuss until when i reach a compromise which is what i believe was done here you know, but uh, how people go perceive them, you know, we able to know, but it is our responsibility for that we ensure, say, we explain to people, make them, you know, and uh, understand exactly what do happen and waiting for happen going forward. And the acceptability level, you get for no say, it can never be 100%. You know, me wish you don't have no go entirely happy about everything we go there inside it. somebody else go there we go entirely happy about all we think we there inside it. but uh the the you cannot run away from it that is leadership you get what take responsibility the fact of the matter is the party going to the dialogue with the approval of the entire uh structures of the party at every level and it is now also our responsibility to ensure say we go back and explain to the people what transpired and what is important to do going forward as a political party, one, and two, as a nation also. We can't run away from that. Now, talking about engaging your supporters after the dialogue for talk about the outcome, somebody will say, why the APC not engage their supporters then before the dialogue? 
We did, actually. You get to understand, say, the party they operate at structural level. We now just grab going to the dialogue. Several meetings were held, several consultations were done at every level. And we go into the dialogue with the blessing of the entire party. At every level, consultation was done. So, of course, we spoke to our membership. And after the dialogue, now we responsibility also for speak to the membership. But we get for know what we want for achieve from the dialogue and two, whether we achieve what we be want from the dialogue. So that is what is important. That is what we need for explain now, make the entire nation know. This is, you know, about elections and elections credibility. It is about, you know, the dignity and human rights of the people of this country. You know, it is about fair. Hello, CD. Hello? That is what we need for explain now to the people, let them understand. And that is also. Now, the All People's are. Congress APC party go into the dialogue with expectation from what in so far they don't, when I don't agree on. You think they want to achieve una expectation or half of an expectation inside this dialogue? Well, to some extent, yes. If you look at we position paper way we present, you know, there are, you know, the main things that will be want, first of all, one, I forget the disaggregated data from the ECSL. And then also there are other things will be put, you know, the release of uh, political prisoners and, and so on and so forth. The agreement not entirely say the ECSL for give data, but what the agreement did, we the reader, it also, they talk about setting up a committee. We go look into elections, 2023 elections around tallying, collation, you know, processes, procedures, and all of those things. You know, and also look at even other elections then for ensure, say, we, 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 we talk around how election results are announced and all that, the coalition and all that. And when you they investigate or when you they set up then kind of review committee day for look at various aspects of elections, it is possible that issues around results could come up. You know, but, you know, we all have to depend on the kind of terms of reference where we get for now develop, you know, for ensure say this particular committee able function properly and well. And then you also get for look at other things that will happen during the elections process where everybody complain about the involvement of security forces, for example, people will lost their lives, people will lost properties and all of them things then they but you cannot preempt. It all have to now get for do it how we all sincerely collectively as a nation, see them and make sure, see, the committee is not about trying to gain, you know, partisan edge, but about really addressing their issues, then they we go ensure, say, we all get trust in we institutions, them, for make them able to function independently and properly as the law say, and for make them able to serve everybody to a way that outcomes of activities or you know some uh we get for do it justice we get for do it elections we get for do it rule of law will be acceptable by all in terms of this um three day i mean just concluded peace mediation why we see some of our supporters they call the party indecision as betrayed and sell out well i mean you get for understand that like i they say you get for no, it, it, you know, going into the dialogue, it all depends on waiting up the expectations of, you know, people at every quarter. You get for understand, say, first of all, the way how everybody see, or most people see the June 2023 election, the anger, the things that we have been really, really been bad to extend that it creates a lot of anger in people. And you go understand why. You know, like I say earlier, people in the way lost families, people in the way, I mean, lost properties, you know, things then they will happen, we're not correct at every level. And then things then they not get for go away. They not get for go away easily. You know, that is why 
and they always emphasize about sincerity. Whatever don't come out from this dialogue, the implementation get for be very important. Everybody get for be committed. Get, everybody get for be sincere. You know, and we also now get huge responsibility for ensure, say, first of all, people understand what can come out from the agreement, whether in fact uh, it addressed the core issues that we, we put forward as a political party and how we get for move away from this, you know, a very important. But you get for understand, say, the anger go there because of what can happen and how people then feel, say, whether in fact some of the things that we then feel strongly about don't be addressed. But it is also important, and I go emphasize this, as I've always done, it is, you know, a dialogue. You know, like we always don't say, you cannot or you may not entirely get what you want, but it is also our responsibility for ensure now, we plenty, continue for um, talk me there around before this dialogue, disaggregated data, rerun of the election. What in exactly APC been wants where they not get out of this dialogue? There are certain things you talk about disaggregated data. People be they expect say maybe at the end of the dialogue the APC for get the data released by the ECSL. That is definitely clear. And people be I know say majority of the people be she say this dialogue will lead me to a rerun. You cannot run away from that. That was the expectation of the majority of the people. But then now we have to go you know, up to the in depth of, you know, waiting happening and how it happened and how we go move forward as a nation. That is what we get for emphasize now to the people, you know, and we get for explain to the people and we get for ensure say, you know, we come out clean and clearly and let them understand what thing happened, how it happened and the important, the importance for let this country you really, really address the issues then they around the elections, you know, so that at the end of the day, we all will get trust in the institutions, them, especially, you know, the, 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 the one we get for do with elections process in this country. A lot of things need for beyond art, but it all depends on how much collectively we all sincerely, sincerely, address the issues that we emanate from the dialogue and how we go implement the agreements we commodity. In conclusion, you support us in the listen to you in the view on Facebook. What's a message of peace to them? I mean for us in the party we always don't don't commit ourselves to peace and quiet. And uh, in the midst of all of this we get for engage and we get for continue for you know, push for them things that we will know say, go, 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 you know, uh, uh, ensure say we continue for live in a peaceful atmosphere as a nation. And then things that we, we go make sure say we continue for hold, we all accountable so that the people of this country will continue for enjoy the rights where they feel say, where the law provide for them. In the midst of all this, I understand the anger as National Police Secretary of the APC. It is, that is why I decided to come this morning for talk to we people. I understand the anger where they go on, but we get for come and explain to Una, for let Una understand what thing happened and what in the agreement. Then we all come down until our term day, where the party will come for address the membership and the supporters. But then we all also know, say, we get only one country, Sierra Leone. And we all go understand, say, the way how we live in this country right now has been so divisive, you know, that um, it not go, all go well for we all. The peace and quiet of Sierra Leone is very important. For then we institutions, they function independently and properly important for we all as a nation. But that does not mean we for sweep under the carpet some of the wrongs we don't happen. We need for address them head on and we need for address them sincerely and in the interest of everybody, 
every single Sierra Leonean, regardless of region, tribe, political party, and all. And so let we all embrace this, you know, as difficult as it may be, as tough as it may be, I think, see, we all go hang heads as a party and as a nation, and I shall say we go move past this, but let us be fair, let us be sincere, and let us be just in doing that, so that we people go benefit. We not go put ourselves before as the beneficiaries, but we go put the people of this country before as the beneficiaries of whatever commodities have been to money. Uh, thank you very much for joining me inside the program in the um, uh, CD Yaya Tini, in uh, the National Publicity Secretary for the All People's Congress APC Party, being the state's then party position of the three day dialogue with Peace Commission and partner them all between the All People's Congress APC Party and the government of Salon. The program now, good morning, Salon. And inside the program now, they come over to the Deputy Minister of Information and Civic Education. Before we take CD, you'll be listening to some of um, people in Africa also didn't give their own view, but they just concluded the day mediation peace dialogue between government and that of the opposition party. You go respond to that later. Also, Rob Moto just wait and see the end of it. Well, I think um, firstly, I want to tell everybody we want to talk to the Vox Pop. Thank you, because obviously, like, um, what we always don't see, um, government, um, people are at the center. At every point in time, we also go for the connect to people, um, no thing that they think, no thing that they view, and also how they self they contribute to governance. So um, from the Vox Pop, we also say there is positive energy, but we people are glad what's in the happen. Like I start by saying, you know, always politicians, them, people, and they say we like fed feds, we like arguments, we like this, but for once, we self don't come together. We don't say one piece. We don't say we support you now. Let me also glad we will get CD. Because before city come, you know, Musa, when they tell me, I say, oh, why APC no can? Because until APC no glad for this, no guy say, una self na the media, una get responsibility. Una responsibility for make sure say, una frame the conversation, we go to enhance peace and enhance national cohesion. Also for the make in the end, no more for bad batting and bad batting no more, you know? We ask why the APC no show up in the dialogue. Uh, Post-dialogue. Yes, but una axam. Yeah, but una axam. Una axam with the influence say some send they not support the agreement. You know, and we not move forward. So now make I say I glad the CD be there on the line. And like I always don't say, oh, they are all. I mean, I want to tell una. At every time where the chief facilitator be the talk, before it end, it tell you say make the two parties then can and can shake hand. And when we can shake hand, we all, you know, the joke, we the laugh, we the talk all kinds of things. I mean, you know, for people that we always they face a police and all day together. We not say for glad now, see, we don't come together, we don't agree, see, election on pass bear. Now we now look at how the big sure see always to go agree, we do implement them and focus on governance. Because at the end of the day, like I say, not to government win, not to APC win, and the people win. Because when you get functional government, if we're able to deliver for the people of this so country. So, Deputy Minister of Information and Civic Education, we think that for be the party involved for ensure they self engage and support her, so that nobody say things that we go to the other side. For let you tell them this same message we don't talk, say, this not to government win, not to APC win, not to CLU, and they win. Well, I start yesterday where I go AYV, and my message for we own party people, mm -hmm. I mean, now, a very clear message. We, na the party within the government, like I always say, after any elections, when they declare results, people are lost, you get responsibility for accept and focus on governance and move forward and see how you contribute. If you self win, you for sure magnanimity, for sure understanding, say indeed, it's not a difficult thing for a person loss. But we as a government, we day, people don't give you the responsibility for carry on with government. That's a big responsibility. And it means, say, we for try as much as we can, but for provoke people, for make sure, say, we encourage people, for make we focus on gov governance, on development, for engage people and constructively, and therefore, are they continue for appeal, for make we make sure, say, law follow the president in footstep. Like, for me, these things that president, I first don't talk, say, now parliament, say, let we dialogue, let we negotiate. We don't do all our day. We are responsible now for make sure, say, we embrace with party in our APC for telling, say, now, low focus on governance, low focus on development, and focus on precedence in big five priority way for make sure, say, we transform country. So, so what next that. now for the country in democracy for ensure, say, democracy not to something no more way people they can't talk about on the radio, but speak to the reality on ground on things that will happen between party them? Well, now I make in the agreement 
between the party that we agree say we will get inter-party meetings and that will take place. SLPP and APC, NGC, any party, we all for the meet and the discuss. Now, like I say, we don't launch the fit salon. We don't put out the manifesto. We want to concentrate and make sure say now we put play, things them in place for deliver on the big five agenda. We for we will focus now. Now it make it important. Let we also get APC for good parliament because then self gets a critical way they play for the governance because when APC the parliament okay go bill then self go use the ideas the experience for make sure say then contribute and add value to the governance process. Now I make also we encourage them back but then take them council seats there. We also want the mayor of Freedom City Council even for also for begin work because we know say Freedom gets challenges there. And that's the goal will be addressed by who gets a mayor will work for the people. Them. And I make even though they, you know, it was smile, me, Yvonne, they talk, they joke, they laugh. Una say, Una glad for that. Also, always for the fet, okay. or for the make palava, for the get singing, and they get me now, the jam jam, we know. Now, we serve the peace. Una support you. Let me thank you to you, Deputy Minister of Information.